So what I've been doing in the lab for the past five or six years is really making new 3D printable materials. We call them 3D paints. So then I started intentionally spilling <laughs> the 3D paints, um, I guess casting them, and things kind of grew from there. The sky's the limit as far as where we can use this. Ultimately, we'd want to create uh, some type of patch or a very sophisticated band-aid in order to regenerate damaged parts. Started making them out of livers, kidney, ovary, uterus, uh, muscle tissue. Most of these tissues purchased from the butcher. We take our decellularized tissue or organ and we grind it into a fine powder. And it's that powder which we use to make the tissue papers. Cells seem to really like it. So the fogal cells um, or the ovarian cells grew very well on it and they were able to produce estrogen. And so we think using this material in combination with those ovarian cells could restore estrogen function. Um, in, in patients who have reduced uh, ovarian function. It really expands what we can do when it comes to creating synthetic environments or synthetic materials for tissue engineering applications.